Hi friends, this is Miss Gigi. How are you guys doing? I miss you. Today I'm going to read to you Five Little Monkeys Reading in Bed. So listen in. Turn on your listening ears. When the five little monkeys are ready for bed, their mama read stories, then kisses each head. Mwah, 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 mwah. It's bedtime for monkeys. Now turn out the light. Oh, mama, oh, please, one more story tonight. But mama is too tired. She's read more than four. Lights out, sweet dreams. She closes their door. One monkey whispers, this book looks so good. If mama won't read it, then maybe we could. Look at all those books they want to read. The monkey start reading. The story is sad. One monkey is weeping. She's feeling so bad. <laughs> then out comes the tissues. They all start to bawl. <laughs> they sob and they cry till the last page of all. It's such a good ending. Their sobs turn to tears. Those monkeys are loud. You should cover your ears. In fact, they're so noisy that Mama runs in. What's all this racket, this chaos, this din? Uh-oh, there's Mama. One monkey admits with a guilt-ridden look, we've been reading the very best happy, sad book. Mama raises an eyebrow. What was it I said? Uh-oh, she's not happy. Lights out, sweet dreams. No more reading in bed. Then one monkey sighs as she turns out the light. I wish we could read this new ghost book tonight. Oh. Just look at the goblin and mean looking ghost. It's those shadowy, shadowy bats that I like the most. One monkey starts hooting an eerie ghost sound and soon they're all wailing and jumping around. Then a dark, spooky shadow appears on the wall, but a knock on their door is what frightens them all. Uh-oh, there's someone knocking on the door. <gasps> it's the ghost! They all scream, but then, what happened? No, it's not a ghost. It's Mama. She walked in. What's all this racket, this chaos, this din? The monkey all gasped. <gasps> we thought you were the ghost. This book is so scary. We like it the most. Mama raises an eyebrow. What was it I said? Oh no. Lights out, sweet dreams. No more reading in bed. One monkey shivers. That book was so creepy, so good, but so scary. I'll never be sleepy. She pulls out a joke book. We've got to be quiet. Shh. But the jokes are so funny, in fact, they're a riot. The monkey tries hard not to giggle or laugh, but then there's a joke with a foolish giraffe. <laughs> so what's the foolish joke? It says, why do giraffes have long necks? So they can wear lots of ties. Look at that tie. It's so silly, so goofy, they all start to roar. And then can you guess who flings open their door? Mm, who's coming? Oh, yes, it's Mama. She comes storming right in. What's all this racket, this chaos, this din? The monkeys keep giggling. They just cannot quit. Mama picks up their books. I've had it. That's it. Then she raises an eyebrow. Did you hear what I said? Lights out, sweet dreams. No more reading in bed. While the monkeys are tired, they're almost asleep. When they hear someone giggle, then laugh and then weep. Do you hear all that noise? And just who can it be? Let's sneak down the hall. Can you guess what they see? Who was making that noise? <gasps> it's Mama. Oh, Mama, what was it you said? They giggled. Lights out, sweet dreams, no more reading in bed. Those monkeys are sleepy. They head out the door. Just wait till tomorrow and then we'll read some more.
Everybody's tired now. Good night, little monkeys. So friends, this is a good book for you guys to read and to listen in if you want to go to bed. So I hope everybody's staying safe, washing your hands, and we will see you soon. We love you guys. Bye.